Hey guys, Lone here, and I'm back with another video after taking a week off from the internet and social media in general because that's how I roll. So for this week's video, I did a very simple ATC card of my cat Houdini, who, if you guys don't know, is my adorable, sassy, sarcastic cat that has claimed me as her preferred human. Um, you might, guys might also know that she takes priority over YouTube whenever she gets sick, obviously. And at about the one minute mark, there will be a picture of her in her little kitty self thing. So, yeah. Um, I actually worked on this all night last night and have not been to bed since. So, like, it's Saturday morning at, like, 9 in the morning right now. Not even gonna lie. And I am very tired, but at the same time, I can't fall asleep. I would like to say kudos to Molten Kitty, who actually kept me company up until about 6 a.m. her time, give or take. So kudos to you, and thank you for keeping me company as I worked on this little ATC card and worked on the video. Um, I probably will be asleep by this point. I don't know. Probably not, though. I do know that I have to clean my markers, though, because markers are looking kind of grungy. But, eh, meh, that's something else for another time. I will say that, like, I'm kind of conflicted with how she turned out. And for those wondering why I chose a pink color to kind of highlight her white hair for her humanized form, it is because when I look at her at times, her skin, which is pink, kind of shows through the fur, so it's like got a little bit of a pink highlight. And then if like the light re is reflected right on her fur, she's got like a red highlight to her hair. So that's why I also used red as an undertone beneath the Y9, or no, not Y, yeah, of the warm gray nine, which is what I used to color her hair and her ears and her tail. Um, but yeah, I just, oh, also kudos to those that voted on my poll on Twitter. This is why I asked for emerald green or rustic gold, because I couldn't decide which color I wanted to go with Houdini's eyes, because they are sometimes the same color. Like, they change. Um, depending on her mood, it seems like, like, whenever she's playful, boom, they're green, and then whenever she's, like, annoyed with me, they're, like, gold, and I'm getting the stink eye, because even though she's a cat, she knows how to deliver one nice stink eye, which makes me feel extremely guilty. Now, she would normally be here to commentate on my audio, like normal, except she's, like, camping out in the bathroom. She doesn't want to leave it, so it's like, okay, I guess I'll do this without you. But it seems like she liked it. She kind of sniffed it and then she licked it. But I think that might be because of the plastic wrapping, like the plastic slider for the card to protect it. So, yeah, I don't need my cat to have a, uh, whatchamacallit, a plastic addiction. Like, nope. Um, we're good. You don't, you don't need that. Nope. So, yeah. Um, she might also seem kind of androgynous. And that is because a lot of people confuse her for a for a male because of her name because she literally just randomly popped up one day out of nowhere and we're just like okay and then she took a liking to me and then we're like okay I guess you're my cat hi how are you doing I don't know why you're bugging me but that's how she came to be she just kind of poof and then she likes to make great escapes outside so that is how she got her name but a lot of people think that she's a guy because of her name, so I kind of wanted to make it look a little androgynous. I don't think I succeeded, but hey, at least I tried. Because that is how I do things. And in case you're wondering about the glove, her paw is actually covered by a black spot there. And I was like, oh, that'd be nifty to give a little paw like that, like a glove thing on her human form. Because I'm going to be honest, she looks like a cow, so. But I love her. She, ah, oh, I love my cake. So, yeah. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I am going to get this done. Then I'm going to render the video and get it uploaded and whatnot. And hopefully later on today, I will have this up on Instagram. So I will see you guys in my next video, uh, whenever that will be. So, 
<laughs> so I will talk to you guys later. And bye bye.